Do you think your booster's power supply isn't working? It doesn't happen often, but if you want to make sure, we have some tips for you. But before we get into that, please subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon so you don't miss anything. Hi, I'm Dan with WeBoost, and if you want to make sure that your booster's power supply is working, here's a couple of things you can do. There are two ways to check if your booster's power supply is working. If you happen to have a voltmeter, you can test it at home. But if not, most stores that sell electronics or auto repair shops will test at little to no cost. But if you're at home and you have a voltmeter, here are some steps to follow. Start by turning on the voltmeter and setting it to 24 volts. Place the negative lead on the outside and positive lead on the center pin of the barrel connector. Check the voltage and the specifications on your booster's power supply to see if they match. If they don't match, you may need a new power supply. If that be the case, we have an awesome customer support team that will help answer any questions you have and help you find a replacement part for your booster. If you have any questions right now, please leave them in the comments section below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel where you receive more videos like this every week. Thanks for watching.